Welcome in everyone and welcome back to the channel. I'm AC Kingpin 27 with you today in Madden 22's Ultimate Team and it's time to upgrade the Browns theme team. If you guys didn't know, I'm running a no money spent Brown squad. I'm not spending any money on Madden points, but I'm doing everything you can do here in Ultimate Team to upgrade. So solo challenges, head to head games, house rules, a little bit of mud draft, I'm knocking everything out, trying to earn some coin, earn some training, and make major upgrades to this Browns theme team. Uh, hopefully, you guys have been paying attention and tuning in to our Mutt Battles gameplay that I've got going out with my buddy Titan. He's running a Titans theme team, and every couple of weeks, we're playing a head-to-head -head game to kind of showcase our upgrades, but also showcase our teams against one another in friendly competition. As always, y'all, drop a like on the video, and I'll continue to put out this Ultimate Team content, whether it's this No Money Spent Upgrade videos or the No Money Spent Mutt Battle series or just the daily Mutt content so you know what's in game. I'm trying to cut those videos to help you build your squad, but also help you understand what's in the game daily so you know what you need to do when you turn the game on. But like I said, it's time to upgrade this team. So we're going to get here. We're going to take a look at how the how the team looked uh, right after the la last Mutt Battles game. So you see we're 95 overall with a 95 offense and a 96 defense. Our last upgrade video was a major upgrade on the defensive side of the ball. Uh, we did bring that Luke Keekley in, that, that Team Diamond 2. Uh, and in this video, I'm looking to really upgrade the offense. We have five big players coming to the offensive side of the ball here. Uh, so this is how the offense looked last game. We're going to have a major, major addition at the wide receiver core, a major addition to the tight end, and we're going to have one new backup uh, at the right tackle position. Uh, we're going to have a new fullback coming in today, um, as well as the potential to possibly have a backup quarterback. I do think we're going to bring a new quarterback in just so everybody that was a Brown in some of these promos at least gets showcased for a game or two. On the defensive side of the ball, there's not going to really be major upgrades today. I believe we've got some upgrade items for that Cam Chancer, so that Ultimate Champion is going to get upgraded. So we're probably looking at a gold 99 on him. And I believe I'm going to shake up the secondary and move some corners around to kind of help, hopefully better out the defense here. But our special teams is going to get some love tonight as well. We're going to have a new kicker and a new punter joining the squad. So I'm excited to get into those and show you guys those. Uh, so without further ado, we're going to head over to the unopened packs section here of Mutt. And we got, I think it's three packs we're going to open. And I'm going to show you some of those players we're bringing to the team. So stay tuned. Now, I've got a handful of unopened packs here in game, but there's three packs in particular I'm looking to open today to showcase to all of you. We have the theme team, kicker, punter, and fullback fantasy pack. Remember, EA dropped theme team starter pack bundles this week for all 32 teams, and you got the opportunity to get a kicker, a punter, and a fullback as part of those. But I went in and spent the 7000 training apiece per pack, so we spent 21000 training total to get three of these packs to guarantee us the kicker, the punter, and the fullback who can get any of the 32 NFL team chems. So we're going to be putting Browns chem on these guys. So let's open this pack up and show you who they are. Coming in first and foremost is a legend. So you're looking at the fullback, Larry Zonka. Again, you're going to be putting Browns chem on him. We're looking at an elite card uh, from the Team Diamonds promo, Morton Anderson. Uh, the kicker coming in with a 91 overall card. And we're looking at the Super Bowl present to go and get Johnny Hecker as our new punter. So all three of these guys will be able to get my team chem. So this is a huge upgrade for me uh, uh, for definitely the kicker and the punter. It's like a 12 or 13 point upgrade for each of them. And it's going to be nice to get a, a better blocking fullback in Larry Zonka. Now I've got two more packs I want to open tonight. Uh, we have this NCAT Combine Fantasy Pack. So this is our reward for completing the challenges. Uh, this is a 94 overall item. So we'll open up this pack. Check out the animations here. Again, I loved every single one of the animations this season. Um, I'm really enjoying the card arts that they're dropping. But what we're bringing is a quarterback item. We're going to bring Tyrod Taylor to the squad. He's probably going to supplant the Dan Marino and be our new backup. So let's lock in Tyrod out of this pack for free. Again, we're not spending very many coin here as we get late into the season and, and start upgrading this team. We've got one more pack I want to I want to open, though. This is our NCAT Fantasy Pack for Wild Card Wednesday weeks 21 through 24. I already locked in and chose flashbacks because I knew which card I wanted to get. So let's open this pack and show you who we're going after. 
Again, the flashbacks animation. I'm loving the animations that we get when opening these cards. We're bringing Josh Gordon. We're going to have an upgraded wide receiver coming to the squad. So this 95 item is going to go into his pup. You're going to be looking at 96 overall Josh Gordon. So I'm hoping for a boosted 97 with the potential to boost him up to 98. We'll have to see how he looks when we get into the squad. But that's it. Like I said, three big packs we're opening. It's time to go upgrade the team. So let's get into the team and let's see what positions we're upgrading, what power-ups we need to throw some training on, and what guys are going to be starting for us for the next Mutt Battles game. Uh, here we go. All right, y'all, we're back here. I had to spend 4,450 coins, and we had to get a couple power-ups. Uh, we had to get the power-up for Justin McRae, who's going to end up being our backup right tackle today. And we had to get the power-up for our backup quarterback, Tyrod Taylor. So it's time now to put all those cards we opened, all those cards we ripped, uh, into these power-ups and upgrade this team. So we're going to start with Tyrod here. You see his power-up already has the Browns cam and has the 84 overall. We're going to spend the training, and we are going to upgrade this card and put that 94 end cat in it and give him up to a 95 today and see how this looks. Uh, we're going to select it from the binder. I just want to be able to showcase just about every card that gets upgrades on the team. I think it's important uh, that we do this this year. I'm really interested uh, to see definitely how the team shakes out with as many upgrades as we get. So I wanted to make sure we're showcasing the guys, even if it's only for a game or two. We might end up bringing the Marino back in here shortly, but Tyrod is now our backup quarterback. No halfback upgrades today. We're still going to run McGahee, Hunt, and Nick Chubb as the three halfbacks, but the fullback is getting another upgrade. Two upgrade weeks in a row, we've got a new fullback item. So Andy Janovich drops down to the full, for the fullback two position, and this Larry Zonka we got is going to get upgraded and get our chems. Uh, so as soon as we unlock our team chems, we're going to put the Browns chem on him. We're going to get a boost for him. So you're seeing 91 right now, uh, and he's going to stay and remain at 91 on the squad. But that's another two-point upgrade at fullback here. Uh, so Larry Zaka coming in with Browns chem, really going to help us out at the fullback position. Hopefully some better blocking can spring McGahee on a couple of those outside runs. The newest wide receiver joining the squad is Josh Gordon. So we had him in there. I think we upgraded him a while back, and I don't think we've ever had him in the lineup. So it's awesome to finally see him cracking it. And he's going to be our new wide receiver too, thanks to that flashbacks item we opened here a little bit earlier. So we're going to spend all this training on him as well. And we're going to get this card boosted up to that 96 overall. I'm hoping with the right strategy items that we have on this card, we could see a 97 or a potential 98 item here. Let's put Josh Gordon on here. Let's change his cover art because we want to see that Browns art all day long. And let's go see, does he boost up? He does boost to a 97. So our top three receivers are 97 overall. You're looking at Devin Hester, Josh Gordon, and now we've got Odell Beckham Jr. in the slot. So I'm thinking a very formidable wide receiving core. Finally, it's taken us this long, but we've still got an upgrade for Odell to make. So I'm going to be very interested to see if we're able to get that LTD item and upgrade Odell Beckham Jr. Now, I talked about the offensive lineman. I talked about Justin McCray. So this is a right guard from Team Builders 3 uh, for the Texans that, you know, used to play for the Browns. Now he gets out of position cams uh, to go to right tackle. So we were able to drop Jack Conklin out of the lineup completely. And we're going to spend the training and we're going to upgrade uh, this McCray. And he's going to be our backup right tackle with hopes later on of getting an upgrade item for Conklin uh, and possibly getting rid of that Tony Baselli. So here we go. We stick the, the, the Team Builder 3 card that we had on him. We change his front art to the team builder, but we also have to change his position. So we're going to go buy that right tackle for 500 uh, training as well. That way we get his boost. You're going to see here he's going to stay at 94 overall um, at the right guard position, but moving him to right tackle, he's going to be a 91. So that's a two-point upgrade over the uh, Conklin that was there. So that's a good upgrade to make for the squad. Again, if Conklin gets an upgrade here throughout the remainder of the season, we're going to be able to get, get, get rid of this Baselli and go after the Taylor Mays from the Season 2 exchange set. So you never know more to come between that Baselli and the Taylor Mays. But the last offensive upgrade comes from the Gridiron Forge. Uh, Gridiron Forge has been giving us free players as we've gone throughout the year. And release 6 of the Forge gave us a 96 overall David Njoku. So I am so excited to spend 18,000 training and get this card upgraded for you guys. 
So let's get in here. Let's spend the training on this card. Let's put that uh, card from the forge on this item and let's get this item to at least a 97 overall. Here we go. Uh, we'll put that 96 in here. I love the card art on this as well. I think that Najoku card art is just fire. We change it to the forge. You see him breaking through the molten steel there. I'm loving the way this card art looks. Uh, looks like we're going to get a boost up to 98. So you're going to see a 97 speed Najoku in the lineup here. Uh, 95 catching traffic. Not a bad tight end card uh, if I don't say so myself. So a brand new starting tight end. Najoku hasn't been starting for a while. So it's good to see him back in the, start, in the starting position there at tight end. That's our offensive upgrades. We're going to head over to the defensive side of the ball. And there's not any upgrades we're making on defense except for one. We're going to make one upgrade to our ultimate champion. We've got the refinal four upgrade collectibles. We need to get this uh, cam chancellor up to the gold 99. So we're going to put in all four of these collectible items. So there's the first one. And that's going to boost his stats. The second one should do the same. And the third one is going to max him out. So remember, if you have one collectible left, this is a boosted cam chancellor right here. You're not going to see any further upgrades on his stats. However, if you get this last upgrade card, you're going to see it unlocks a plus one hit power for anybody with a strong safety or free safety chem. So we absolutely want to do that for the card. So we're going to put the last one, and that means all of our safeties now are looking to have uh, that, that hard-nosed plus one hit power uh, to them. So hopefully we're able to cause some havoc for Titans' run game and his pass game as we're able to knock the ball out of everybody's hand. So that's our fourth, fourth 99 overall player of the season. I think that's our second gold 99, and both of them on the defensive side of the ball. So very exciting there. The only other change I made on the defense was I did demote Buster Screen, and we promoted Greg Newsom back. Uh, I'm missing Greg Newsom's 99 speed and 98 zone coverage. Buster Screen just wasn't there in zone coverage. I think he was only 94 overall. So I wanted to make sure that we brought Greg Newsom back into the starting slot corner position here and try to help us out against Titans' formidable uh, passing attack. But we've got two other upgrades. Those two hidden upgrades from that training pack. We've got a new kicker and a new punter. So first up is the punter, Johnny Hecker. We've got to go spend a little bit of training here. So we'll spend five training, and we're going to get position chems on him. We're going to make sure that Johnny Hecker gets the Browns chems here. So there he is. And our kicker now is none other than Morton Anderson. We're going to spend a little bit of training on him too. Uh, we'll make sure we get his position chemmed out as well. And we'll put the Browns uh, team chem on him to make sure he's boosting. And we have all the Browns available on this lineup. And that's going to put us at 60 of 50 Browns. I think we're really rocking out with this team team. Everybody's got Browns cam. Everybody's good to go. I'm excited to what might happen here. And it looks like our overall went up a little bit. So let's go see how the overall shakes out on both the offense and the defense with the team overall boosting to that 96. All right, all right. I talked about it. We hit 96 overall with this with the squad finally. Our defense remained at 96, but our offense got a huge boost and is now showing 96 overall. So we're at 96 overall across the board. And looking at the three top players, still looking at three defensive superstars here, all 99, two of them gold 99s as we get ready for the next Mutt Battles game. I hope you guys are enjoying this no money spent Browns theme team upgrade series that we've got going on, showcasing it from the beginning of the season till now with all the upgrades we've been able to do. Uh, hopefully uh, you guys are enjoying the Mutt Battle series. We're also doing, like I said, every other week with Titan. We're getting here and playing a head-to-head -head game. There's lots of good laughs and some good games the last couple of games, the last couple of weeks. So stay, stay, stay tuned to the channel. Hopefully you're tuned into those. I appreciate that. Appreciate you guys all being here. Hope, leave me a comment down below. Let me know how your team stacks up against mine. What type of squad you're running. If you're running a theme team, let me know what team you guys are running. If you're running a combination of a couple different teams, I'd love to hear about it. And I'm always in the chat on the comments, chatting with all of you. So hopefully you guys are in there chatting up with me. Uh, as always, thank you so much for being here. Stay tuned for more Ultimate Team content. Whether it's the No Money Spent Browns upgrades or the daily content, we're going to continue to put the videos out for you. Uh, I appreciate you guys all being here. I'll catch you next time. Have a great week. Have a safe week. We'll see you guys soon.